important on one of these is uh, the, the shift cable. The shift cable is a very important feature of the way this single lever transmission operates. Let me, uh, he, he's getting the shift cable, so I was going to make a, a, a very <clears throat> important um, information here, and that is, you can see this actually is the end here that connects to the steering column. This, as you can see, and you can see that this has been off, and we verified this cable works this free. You have to verify. It's a must. You have to verify this cable operates this smooth. It would not be uncommon to find this metal casing worn or chafed um, or sometimes even split. If it is, it affects the shift ability completely. You remember this cable actually is what they call uh, the gate cable. It actually uh, operates the gate. This one obviously operates very free. Even in its bent position, it should work pretty free. And it does, okay? So <clears throat> with that said, you can see this has a, uh, I call it a double D. That double D fits onto the shift shaft. And it has to be true and square onto the shaft. So, this double D, if you look, it has to fit right onto the shift shaft coming up vertically in the transmission. Something that you should do, verify, because this shaft is vertical and it's underneath the vehicle, it's not uncommon to find that shaft is a little sticky or sometimes it just uh, froze up. That will obviously, even if this is connected to it, if the shaft inside the transmission is froze up, it cannot move the shift gate lever inside the transmission. Obviously, limit your travel of how much you're gonna be able to shift, cause all kinds of adjustment problems, which you know we'll talk about in another video. Just to verify mine is smooth, this particular transmission, I know it is, but just wanna show you that you can simply take a pair of pliers and you can hear this move back and forth inside. It has to do that. That verifies that it's nice freely operating. So we're gonna install the part that goes in the shift shaft first, not where it bolts down. Shift shaft first. We're gonna put it right on there. Make sure it is lined up exactly like it needs to be, which we've got it down on there. These are a, uh, a relative, a press fit. Um, and fits snug and secure. So stick your flat washer on, which is required, a lock washer, and the nut. So we're gonna put that back on like this. And you drop the nut and chase it. Usually I don't have assistance and it's So now, let's just operate this manually. It does. We're going to simply swing this bracket over here. Line the whole, I usually line one side up first, the back first. Then line the other up. Make sure they're good and started correctly. Now we should be able to take this, you can hear that actuate and move. That means the leverage that the shifter inside the vehicle um, allows and provides will mean this will operate smoothly. And that is a very, very important feature of the single lever Hudson built transmission.